they love to sing along with us, so they're not coming to the shows and getting all depressed or anything. <laughs> Just because we're talking about social issues yeah, and some yeah. of the songs, they're having a good time, so it's a mix. Does it, does it happen when sometimes you may want to write a song about one issue and the other doesn't agree? Uh, is there a, does that song get me? Or what, what happens there? <laughs> Rarely. I mean, we have pretty similar value systems. So we, we speak about things differently sometimes. But we're pretty, you know, we write separately and come together and arrange it together. And if there's songs that we think should be song people alone, we just leave them alone. Make just Do you feel like music has involved over the years? Involved in that early on, we, we came for being a bar band, we pretty much just went straight into the and did that. And then we learned to work with different musical textures, so we picked up different instruments. And if you pick up a mandolin as opposed to a guitar, you might write a completely different song. So I think we've grown musically. And then now, at this point in life, I think this latest record, which isn't out there yet, but it's called Poseidon and the Bitter Bud, it's very reflective of where, how old we are, what we're reflecting on in life. You know, we just came from eight years as a Bush regime. Now we have Obama. There's a lot to think about politically shifting. And I think that um, we have become better crafts people in terms of songwriting. And we just, uh, you know, we're old now. <laughs> <laughs> we're all getting older. But let's talk a bit about that, that issue. I mean, what's your take on the, the new Obama administration? Uh, we're happy. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> we're happy. I mean, it's, it's for us, you know.